Assalamu uh, alaikum. Good early morning to everybody. Uh, today is uh, June uh, 30th, 2020. The time right now it's 3.05 a.m. 3.05 a.m. Early morning. Uh, just I want to share with you guys my findings regarding the uh, Midway Island uh, which supposedly be at the west of the world and the other and the other uh, island which is at east of the world which is Wake Island uh, first of all we want to state some uh, facts that it's been given to us by what they call uh, Google Earth so we will go to Google Earth and find out the distance this is the Midway Island as I'm showing showing it to you Midway Island at all so we will do just like this to calculate to calculate the the, the distance between those both islands in uh, nautical mile in nautical mile just let's do it. I found it earlier before. It is almost 1,000 nautical mile. 1,000 plus like uh, 20, something like that. 20, 25. Neglected due to the 1,000 itself. So let's find out. This is Midway Island. And uh, now we are seeking the, the total distance. Uh, the computer a little bit slow. So we have to wait until it recognizes what I'm going to do. Still here. It's getting uh, refreshed by itself. Down there. So uh, we are waiting for the computer to overcome its freezing position. Uh, Oh my god, I lost the day. Now it's getting increased to 56%. Yeah, yeah, now 66%, which is good. Great. Uh, here. Okay. Come on, come on, come on, yeah. That's Wake Island down there. Yeah, it's Wake Island. As you can see there so we will go to Wake Island and just zoom in so we can get the correct exactly measures which is as I told you guys it's almost uh, 1025 uh, nautical mile that's in nautical mile actually uh, nautical mile 1025 nautical mile that's all from wake island to midway island or from midway island to wake island it is 1025 nautical mile then let's go back to the thing that we are looking for over here uh, uh, as you are aware guys this is the data i'm getting from timeanddate.com and this is the information i got for midway island U.S. minor outlying islands, sunrise, sunset, and day length, June 2020. That's the date here. That's the date, 29th, June 2020. Time is now 12.09. That's afternoon, means mid-noon, mid noontime. And the sun direction is 114.923 east southeast east southeast and the sun altitude is almost 90 uh, 79 degrees 
and sunrise today or the sun already rose at 5:55 a.m. and with 63 degrees northeast sunset today it will set uh, on uh, 1950 uh, at this degree 297 and uh, we I went to the wake island itself US minor outlying islands sunrise Sunset and day length June 2020 20, and this is the data over here uh, June uh, 30th June 2020 1110 so the gap is one hour the here the gap we can see the gap here that's 1210 and here 1110 on uh, on Wake Island Again, some problems. Okay, 11, 11 at Wake Island. And here the map, here Wake Island. And on the other side, this is Midway Island. So uh, in Wake Island, the sun direction is 76.37 east, northeast, guys. East, northeast. Here the key. Here the key that we are talking about. And look to the sunrise, 6.18 a.m., 65 east, and sun set today, 19.35, 295 northwest. That's the main uh, information we got. Then I used that and I put it in that uh, 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 note paper or book, notebook, and uh, just we will uh, refresh what we just spoke about uh, here the wake island sunrise as what we said and sunset and sunrise for midway uh, sunrise for midway 55 the gap is 23 minutes only 23 minutes okay and the date here 29th june 20 and here one day after which is 30th and the gap is 23 minutes guys 23 minutes the distance is 1020 nautical miles that's all one hour gap in the timing or time zone uh, sunset 1935 here sunset 1950 as I showed you okay and sun direction here the key east northeast for wake island east northeast this happens only if the island at the south region. So you can see the sun moves from east to north to east. East, northeast and moving towards the north. That's the common movement for the sun for the uh, southern part. Uh, meanwhile, in the northern area, the sun has to move east, southeast because the island at the at the uh, north at the north so what we have been there in the in the map itself it is purely fake it's purely fake the the the, the total uh, position of the islands both of them comparing to each other it's totally fake not true that island it's actually at the north and that island at the south this island at the east this island at the west one more thing to tell you guys due to the this phenomenon phenomenon i said up up means opposite opposite means this sun which is here it's totally different than this sun which is here fake position the island at the south fake position the island at the north this is the conclusion that we got due to the sun movement due to the sun movement uh, that's the main thing that i want to express to you and give you that information uh, what they are already showing us it is not true uh, actually there is a gap of uh, to only 15 minutes between the two sunsets the two sunsets only the gap is 15 minutes 
but in the rising time it's 23 minutes with different direction this the island here at the north so the sun do like this and the island here at the south so the sun do like that so they are totally in different uh, place means uh, this is at the north hemisphere and that island which is wake island at southern hemisphere so that we have different arcs for uh, opposite arcs actually for both islands uh, uh, that's what i want to share with you guys uh, hopefully you understand guys what i mean or what i meant by uh, showing you this uh, small uh, analysis uh, to just uh, uh, refresh your mind actually uh, in order just to wake up uh, uh, I will go back again to the islands it, uh, both of them I will show you the the wake island that's wake island and you can see here the the sun direction sun direction has to be reduced I means 67 point one seven it has to go 1.16 that's the, what's happening then that thing will be instead of east northeast it will be northeast then it will move to the northwest then the time that it has to sit okay and it's opposite for it's opposite for the other island which is midway island here this number has to be gained again gained because the direction is east southeast east southeast look to the altitude uh, 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 altitude 80 point say half and here the altitude less 66 42 66 and there 80 and there 80 so that's completely different suns the sun in the northern hemisphere it's totally differ, different than or differ than the sun at the southern hemisphere and the proof is the two islands which shown there in google map that they are just 1000 nautical mile in a distance but they have one hour plus 23 so one hour plus 23 that's that's the timing that's the one hour gap plus 23 that's the sun uh, rising time so when the sun here uh, at midway island at 555 at 555 the timing here is 455 so it needs one hour and 23 minutes to rise here but the distance is only 1020 nautical miles that's impossible that's as per the map impossible impossible uh, it's totally in different region different place uh, that's at the west of the world this is at the east of the world and this island at the south of the world and this island at the north of the world that's the proof which is undebunkable and it's based on the information that they are showing it's not from me it's from them timeanddate.com uh, please refer to those uh, informations if you have any doubts and uh, i'm waiting for your comments guys who's uh, interested to discuss this phenomenon Salih uh, al-Wahdi flat earth organization uh, uh, thank you bye